Hello, it's Priscilla here. I have a question for you all. Did Sai ever tell you he has feelings for anyone? It's just that he's acting strangely around me these days. And I'm guessing it's because he likes me? Have you ever been in a situation similar to Priscilla's? Knowing that your friend has romantic feelings for you can help you decide what your next step should be in this friendship. You don't want to ruin your already established friendship, but you also don't want to miss the chance for something profound and romantic with them. So with that said, here are some signs that you might just be more than friends. Number one, they ask you about your relationship status. Do they always seem to steer the conversation back to your relationship status, no matter what you're talking about? Are they curious who you have a crush on? Or did they tactfully ask about your type? They might be doing this to see if they could be your romantic partner. If your friend is romantically interested in you, they will want to know if the feelings are mutual. They may try to determine precisely what you're looking for and whether or not they're your ideal type to avoid any chances of rejection. Number two, they express their care through preening. Are they picking lint off your clothes? Or maybe you're both eating burgers at McDonald's without realizing you've got cheese on your face. They chuckle at your clumsy eating habits and instinctively reach out to wipe the cheese from your face. Have you ever had a K-drama moment like this? If you have, leave some butterflies in the comment section. What they're doing is called preening, which is the act of wanting to ensure that the person you care about looks tidy and neat. It could be their way of expressing genuine love and care for you. So if they look after you in this way, it may be a sign that they wanna take the friendship to the next level. Number three, they lean towards you. According to an article by behavioral specialist, Jack Schaefer, you lean towards people you like and away from ones you dislike. So have you ever sat on a bench completely engrossed in your conversation until you noticed them staring at you and gently leaning in towards you? And finally, you two can, uh-oh, let's save that kiss for later. Until then, keep an eye out for physical proximity between the two of you because it's a sign that they wanna be more than just friends. Number four, nothing can come between us. Another subtle sign that they have romantic feelings for you is if they remove some sort of barrier between you two when you sit together. Maybe it's their bags, a cup of coffee, or even just a cushion. They set it aside and scoot closer to you. It's a sign that they're into you and wanna become special to you. Remember when they say nothing comes between you two, it meant literally here. Number five, they have nicknames for you. Do they only refer to you by nicknames among all your friends in the group? Have you considered why? Maybe they refer to you with a cute nickname. If they are ready to let you know their feelings, they may refer to you with some sweet nicknames like Bay or Sunshine. However, they could also conceal their feelings by referring to you as strange nicknames until they're sure of your feelings. They're probably trying to catch your attention with those quirky nicknames, and it could be their way of saying, let's get together already. Number six, the way their texting changes. The texting game is an entirely different ball game. It's natural for people to feel more confident when communicating with someone via social media rather than in person. So are there more hearts, kisses, or smiley emojis in their chats now than before? Do you feel they frequently ask you lots of questions to keep the conversation going? And rather than just a simple yes or no, do they reply to your questions immediately and with full explanations? If you notice any of these changes in your conversations, it's a sign that friendship with you is just not enough. Number seven, they flirt with you. Is your friend flirting just with you? If that's a yes, it's one of the surest signs they like you. Maybe they're just scared of confessing before they're certain of your feelings because they don't wish to ruin your friendship at any cost. Do you also subtly flirt back with your friend? Even if it might seem like a fun, lighthearted, harmless conversation between you two, it might just be a cover to hide your feelings for each other. And number eight, you can feel your friendship changing. Regardless of the signs we provide, if you have a gut feeling that you're already acting like a couple, it is most likely true. Maybe you both hold each other's gaze for longer than usual and then blush or perhaps you spend the entire day together sharing intimate details about your lives that you don't share with anyone else. Or maybe the same friendly hug feels different now, as if they wanna hold you forever. Do you feel as if love is in the air? All these small changes in your friendship may indicate that things have escalated between you and you're no longer just friends. Did you notice any of the above signs in your friend? Wait, maybe you find yourself doing these things as well. If that's the case, then you both might be trying to take your friendship to the next stage and are more than just friends. Let's see what Priscilla is up to now that she's aware of these signs. Hey, Sai, what are you up to these days? I mean, aside from making me fall in love with you. Did you just? Priscilla was able to advance her relationship because she loves and supports us. Less than Sai, but that's all we need. 
Above all, she stays informed about psychology and mental health by sticking with us. How about you like and subscribe to our channel and share this video with friends? Who knows, you might as well take things a step further with someone special. If you have, share with us in the comments. The references used are in the description. Until next time, friends, thanks for watching and see you soon.